What are they doing, boys? Sick, come on. Well, y'all gonna have to excuse me. Oh, we do a little hunting here. We can talk mud buddy motors, we can talk whatever, but we're gonna shoot some beasts too at that same time. Oh, them boys is way too close. Come on down here. Oh, it was within range. I think they should have shot him. What are they waiting on? Maybe they're going to do it right now. Let's see him. Come on. Oh, yeah. Big boy coming in. Big boy to the right. They're going to line up and do it right, huh? Come on, boys. Come up in here. What are they higher now? Listen, when them bees get close enough, you got to shoot them, boys. That's all there is to it. They was 20 yards from us, but because they wasn't down in the decoys, the boys didn't call the shot. They better do it. <laughs> Sit. No bird thief. You just wait. Oh, sit. Boy, that first time that was a lot closer, dang it. Well, we've been having ourselves a good day. Trying to get that one closer. I gotta tell you. I said the first time it was close now. You thought they were going to put their feet... They got a little spooky, didn't they? Yeah. some reason. I think we ought to pick that phone one up out there. and Way out there. That way we don't have them try to sit out there when they start really coming. That's the only one that went down? No, there no. no you, there's, there's four or five out there. One went way over there, too. I can't remember that boy's name. What's his name? Clayton. Clayton. That's his dog, Chief. Chief is a pretty strong dog. He's been doing good. See run out there and pick up a uh, goose. He said, what about this See, one right I'm here, Daddy? Do, I'm going to have to zoom out past. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Get back down. Heel. Heel. Sit. He coming back. We'll pick up the rest of them here in a minute. We got some more geese trying to set on us. But I don't know if y'all talk duck hunting, waterfowling, dog training. It don't matter. Heel. Lie down. Lie. Get your butt under there, dog. They still trying to work it, ain't they? Come on. Come on. I'm an echo guy. I blow nothing but echo calls. My favorite is XLT, extra loud timber. My echo call. Come on down, y'all, goose. It's an extremely versatile call. It's got a lot of range to it. It's uh, you can get real soft and nasty, or you can you can get pretty doggone loud. Come on, boys, y'all. Let's see if we can't knock us snot out of these goose. We're up here in Northeast Arkansas hunting with Northern Skies Outfitters, and we've been doing it all day long, just like this right here. Y'all see that up there? I had to pull out the big gun for this one right here. I ain't kidding you. And the reason, cause I've been, 
I've been running this gun empty almost every single time, shooting 10 rounds every single time. Come on down here. Come on down here. Tell me. Come on. Tell me that don't make you tickle. I guarantee that. If that don't tickle you boys, you ain't ticklish, I don't guess. Come on. Get down, y'all. Get on the end of my gun. Ooh, Morton. You see that band? You see that band up there, Morton? Look at them, they're dropping straight down. Somebody gonna get uh, in the head right here. Come on. Uh-huh. That looks like that's pretty close to me. He gonna, he gonna kill me. Good dog. See that gooseway over there, thing? Huh? You wanna get that long one? Huh? Another one going way down, way over by the tree. We'll get them picked up here in a minute. Come on, get us some more now. Come on back over here. Boy, that right there is pretty, ain't it? Is that why you do this stuff, huh? Is that why you mortgage your house? You got like three divorces? I mean, come on, ain't it? Come on, load that thing. Keep pumping them up in there. It's fully loaded. It's heavy, too. Come on. You just wait it out, buddy. Well, you ain't got your camera skills down yet, boy. I guarantee you it's raining geese. But no, I'm shooting right now. I'm shooting a Rob Roberts. <laughs> My big bad boy right here. I got to watch out. I'll lose service, boys. I hope I hope it ain't too grainy. Hope everything's nice and clear where you can see what's going on. Boy, y'all y'all put the hurt on them that time. I didn't even pick up my gun. Yeah, I don't think he's going nowhere. We got one right there that's got the potential to leave. We got one out there that's got the potential to leave. Clayton, did you, you see want to get that in Clayton? I'll get this one if you get that one. Did you see that snow Here. that went to the tree line? Heel. 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 Sit. Dead bird. Back. On driving dog there you go oh that goose ain't got a chance that goose ain't got no chance I guarantee it come on over there 500 yards away we'll have to do the hunt up here in a minute here here bring me that thing here, 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 sit. Get it. Dead bird. Back. You're gonna roll yourself. Come on, boy, hurry. We got some dang geese to shoot. Come on. Hell yeah, Bob. Here. Heel. Sit. Get it? Here. Here. Sit. No. Good. Back. We've been knocking a snot out of them, Mr. Ogden. I guarantee it. Right there. I guarantee you right there. We're trying to beat 500 today, ain't we? I just don't know if it's going to happen. <laughs> it's going to be tough. It's going to be tough. Y'all check your setup up right here now. Now, when you want to shoot snow, my gosh, if you can ever get a setup like this and it happen, it's perfect. 
Look at that. Yes, sir. There's a few more out there. We'll get them here in a minute. They, huh. I don't even think we need to shoot at them. We could probably just ugly them half to death. <laughs> Come on, get up in here. Uh -uh, here, here. Right here. Place. Now, I will say this is actually Thief's first time they ever hunt out of a blind. First time. He had to learn it all day. It's a learning curve, but he got it down now. The sun's killing me. Sun's killing you? For where they're they're getting to start to get shot now, it, it's not going to work. Now, if y'all want to talk about camera work, Mr. Morton here, he'll lead you all through the process to catch good quality footage. Yeah, the lighting's not good for the angle of where they're calling the kill shot. So. <laughs> I, got them, did I did get three kill shots, though. Did you? Mm -hmm. You know what? I got all of them! <laughs> I you did. You didn't shoot. <laughs> I got all of them. I got them, did it. Uh... Come on, we need like 14 more groups to do that right there. That It'll probably be another 20, 30 minutes before it happened again. I don't think so, though. Boy, the way those were all oh, man. doing the deal, they wasn't they wasn't even beginning to wait on it. A lot less than this, too. With oh, yeah. Too. Now, this morning, I promise you, correct me if I'm wrong. Was there seven or eight thousand birds above us at one time? Yeah, it was crazy. They were it was crazy, crazy. Running. We've been out here all day. Running into each other up there. Sun's He's picking up another one way out there. Is there another long one I need there to get? There it is. It's all the way. Uh, you see where the uh, deer is we thought was the deer? Uh, yeah. To the left of it, you see that stump coming up in between those two trees? About yeah. About foot. It's Right to the left of that, right over there. How far to the left of it? All the way to the line, to the tree line. If I could see some white, I'd cast him. I don't, when you get a dog that far away, you don't want to cast them into something like that because the son of a guns could get hung up in a fence. Ain't no telling. Be a cow down there. But we will walk down there and we will retrieve that bird later on. I got him, did it. We went on the other side. It's on the other side of the river then. I think you was too busy shooting to notice anything falling. No. Except for at the end of my barrel. <laughs> I guarantee it. All right, here. Sit. Sit. We need some more geese. Come on, gooses. Uh, it looks like it's just going to be a lull in the action now. We done rained it on twice. We can talk about anything y'all want to. Motors, dog training, shotguns. We we talk about glad duck season's over. We set up on the side of a winter wheat field that had corn in it. And the geese have literally eaten up all everything in the middle and they're starting to work right up against the edge, which is actually perfect for this type of setup. Wind's coming off my left shoulder, kind of a as y'all saw how they's working coming in from right to left we're side shooting them that way a lot of hunters here they're not seeing everybody and we up in northeast arkansas with northern skies outfitters you know if we'd have had this wind this morning oh we that, that group, we'd, we'd already gone back for two four more cases <laughs> no no we yeah for <laughs> I can't picking up all the ones that we <laughs> probably it'd be crazy and you, guess what i could have got a lot better camera footage this morning oh yeah well do you know that. you don't ever want to film into that big bright big big bright shiny thing over there that ain't no good we need some geese though come on gooses well i got everybody here you know a little into action you know when it comes to pups i don't i don't ever look hardly any further than a few people. Chris Aiken being the top. I'm just a real fan of that boomer line and always have been. Here's three right here. 
Where's three? Right behind us. Are they close? Yep. Are they coming? If they're coming, I don't know if they're going to come in, but they are coming. Well, let's get down here and see if we can't shoot them. Where they at? Give me some heads up. Tell me something, boy. Well, they're kind of just barely floating around because it looks like they're fighting wind. They're coming right over you. I'm only two foot from you. Well, look up. <laughs> Hello. Hello. I can't find them. Hello. Come on, Goose. Where you at? Oh, that. Man, them things is way up there. Oh, them speckle bellies. We can't shoot them, boy. They might decoy on down in here and be fun to watch. But it's going to be a long time before they make it from up there down. I think it's speckled down. All I hear is that big thing over there. Uh, they might be. We need to hurry up and get another one in big groups. And so these boys get to watch them get shot the snot out of again because our setup has been absolutely working y'all saw how pretty them was a while ago come on now are they calling through the same three I can't hardly see out this thing. But I'm going to tell y'all, you know, we're going to talk a little bit about duck hunting, what went on this past year here in the state of Arkansas. Now, you want to talk about tough, 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 tough situation. We didn't have any rains, you know. I'm one of the Echo Boys. We do our thing together and all that kind of mess. And literally, we the places we hunt they did not get any water at all none no water and that whole tributary system stayed dry you're talking about 700 to 800 thousand acres that stayed dry and that put a hurt on us because a lot of places we hunted we didn't we didn't we didn't get we didn't get to hunt the places we grew up hunting and, and know real well we didn't get to hunt those so we had to hunt outside the box. We hit a lot of oxbow lakes. We hit a lot of river systems and just hunting sandbars and banks and just off the wall stuff. Man, he's turning that thing up. That's loud. He got it cranking. He's trying to pull them from the next county. But as all duck hunters, waterfowlers do, we all say, well, next year, always next year. We're going to get them next year. I don't think them geese is coming. <laughs> I hear some. Where they at? I have no idea. Oh, I see them. They're waiting. They're, co they're coming. Uh, yeah, they're coming toward us. You see them fighting? There's some high ones coming straight toward us off that tree line. To the right? Yeah. Way out there. But we have been, it's been about. Let's flip this thing around a little bit. It's been about every 25 minutes or so, we get a big, big group down. But they're just now starting to fly good again this afternoon. Don't let them sneak in here on me. Where you got them, Martin? Oh, they coming. They coming? Yeah. Big group? Yeah, it's a big group. Coming right over the tree line. About the same height the last one's come from. Uh, that's a good height. You see them? Not yet, but I will. Okay. I'll find them here in a minute when they get close enough to worry about. Who? Come on, ducks or geese. You know this ain't something we normally do right here. We used to talk to ducks. But it, I guarantee you, but it is fun to do. What at? Right. Are they still making it this way? No, they're not making it this way. I 
I can't see nothing. That sun's so bright, it's killing me. They're straight to the right of you. Hey, they're, they're engaging. They're engaging? Yep, here they come. They turned right toward us. Uh huh. And they're dropping. Let's see. We turn this thing around so we can see if we can't smack one of these suckers. Come on. Dang, I need to clip my nose hairs, don't I? Where that, where that, where that goose at? I hear buttons. Oh, they're getting closer. They're coming up. Oh, they're trying it. Let's see if these do it so pretty like them last one. I had to get down here, get sucked up in here so they don't see me. What's two? Two to the right, coming on the deck. No, like fixing to shoot them? Die, yes. I don't see them. I better be. See that one? Oh, you talking about that one? Oh, I see. That's the one you're talking about. <laughs> see it. Oh, we got away. Oh, we got away. I guess I should have had my gun. Oh, well. I'll stop for a second. <laughs> I hear you, Mr. Ogden. Sit. I almost, if I would have knocked the camera over a half second later, I'd have got myself shooting that one. Uh, I thought we was going to wait on that big group. Ha! <laughs> uh, but anyway, we're having one fine time sitting out in the field. This afternoon. You did see that big group dropping down, huh? No. <laughs> we done passed all that. Huh? We done passed all that. I guarantee you we done passed all that. We left all that back in duck season, not waiting on nothing no more. Killing it. If it's in range, shoot it, boys. I guarantee you. I hear more geese. I hear more geese. Cause I guarantee you a bird in a hand is better than a squirrel in the britches. Oh yeah, come on behind guys. Heel. Heel. Lie down. Lie. Old thief, he's done figured out. He got to keep his head steady. Keep down. Come on, where they at? We'll just take y'all on an all day afternoon goose hunt. Y'all sure ain't asking no kind of question. They just watching. They like, shoot some damn geese, boys. They just want to see stuff die. They bad as me. Y'all tell me, is is it is it very grainy? Can y'all see what's going on? Is the service good enough? You got geese with that. Better load this down before I flare something. I get in trouble. He's getting louder and louder and louder with that machine. Let me know where they at. I heard them a while ago. I can't see them. You darn right I remember my first duck on ever. There's my Papa Douche y'all down in the marsh in Louisiana. I was, heck, I was probably about seven, eight years old. Kind of look for me. But I'll never forget, saw one big old drake drop in there just as pretty and just, you know, just one of them look deals. Gramp said, shoot that thing, huh? And I did. Hey, I ain't talking to you, dog. Get back down in there. Lie down. Get back in there. Keep your head in there, dog. And I happened to just accidentally kill that duck. And ever since then, I've been shooting ducks. Where they at? You think they won't come here? 
I try to hold the phone up a little bit more. Y'all know how this AT&T service is. This up. Come on, Goose. Y'all hurry up bring something else up in here. Y'all done seen this volley on three times. Maybe we can get four in here. I wasn't. I had to go up and over this right here to see it. I didn't know it was that low. Come on now, Goose. I think that thing's calling so loud it scared them. But, the, but there's one that was kind of locked up, but he ain't going to do it. We need them to be from way to our right. You know why we want them from our right? Because the lighting is better that way. The lighting is a lot better. I hear you there, Jake. You hear a lot of birds in the area right now. That's awesome of them right there, Jeremy. That is awesome. You just keep at it. Little steps lead to big dogs. I will guarantee it, brother. What he calling that again? He getting louder and louder, that machine. I ain't gonna lie to nobody. My favorite camel pattern on the XL Mud Buddy combo will always be Drake Old School. Always be. Now, I don't know how available that's going to be in the coming years, but for darn sure in my book, always. Drake old school. It just looks great in the temple. Come on, one up. Straight up. Oh, we got, we about to have some drop in on this while I'm snapping my gun right here, boy. It's just a couple, but come on around. I keep thinking of somebody laughing, but it's that dude. Oh, look at that. Look how they dropping down right there, boy. These two are just dropping. Let me hold that up out right there. They're way up there. They're little bitty dots, but they're making circles real hard coming down. Oh, let me see if I can do some zooming. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, ooh, come on down here. Come on down here, find the end of this butter stick, boy. I'm gonna rub it on you. Come on. Come on. Come on. Ooh, I can't believe he didn't call it right there. That's right there on my face. If you get any closer to me, I'm gonna taste him. I can't believe he didn't say shoot. I guess he don't like the way his feathers look. Then he gonna put them all the way down in the decoy. Oh, you can be over there in the sun now. What you making noise for, boy? Oh, around they go. They back there. Who said, dog? Uh -oh. my, my thing flew open. Uh, sit. Get down, dog. Sit. Oh, well, they fixing to do it right here. Dead goose. Sit. Sit. Don't go down. Sit. Good dog. I guarantee it. Thief. Shoot that goose in the head, boy. Come on. Come on, pick that thing up, dog. Let's go. That'll wait, Boy, that's that pretty when they do it like that, that ain't it? I gonna do it. Yeah. Come on. Right here. What you gonna do, dog? You gonna chew on it or you gonna bring it to me? You got your another one out there, Chief. You wanna pick him up? What the heck is that? Ah, what the heck is that? He, he biting you. I knew you was messing with me. <laughs> Sit. Watch yourself now. Coming at you. Ugh. 
Boy, that's a left-handed girl throw, wasn't it? Did you see that discus? <laughs> he done been goose. That's right, Elliot. He back there. If you flare us, some don't you flare no ducks with that. I'm trying not to. That gun boy messing around with the camera stuff. Come on, we need a big wad. Yeah. They do it right, I'm telling you. They do it. We get a big wad, I'm going to end this right here, like right now. Mm -hmm. They'll be going, why's the phone falling? I love them videos. You get all this and all of a sudden it... Oh, yeah. Uh-oh. He'll sit. Lie. Lie down. Put your butt down in there, dog. What is that? No, oh, that ain't the right type of goose. <laughs> that Andy. Boy, that was about weak, wasn't it? I guarantee it. That was about weak. Yeah, what's some geese out there? They might accidentally do something. So he turns that volume up. I swear. It gets so loud. Holy smoke, it's loud. That's loud, ain't it? Golly. Uh-oh. They ain't locked up bigger than Dallas. Boy, quit tinkering with that piece of mechanic equipment. Uh-oh. Get your gun. What you doing? Well, the strap ain't got nothing to do with recording. Well, yeah. I don't think it's going to matter to these geese. They are way up there. I don't think y'all can see them, but they itty bitty bitty dots. And they are making some circles like, hey, we coming. It might take us two days to get there, but we coming. They're making a long circle, so we uh, we could talk about building houses and all that kind of mess. I just keep on rolling. What am I doing? I swear I hear a laughing hyena on that thing. <laughs> yeah. Are you still tinkering with that? That little boy. Hey, look out front right here. Ooh. Oh, them's all specs. Don't you shoot into them, boy. That ain't good. Come on. Now, y'all ain't talking about no duck hunt. Y'all just sitting there watching. I thought y'all was going to talk about something. You know, he's getting quiet now. Usually when you get quiet, they're close. But they ain't nowhere close. Oh, they sliding off. Once they get down there on that south side, buddy, they, they gone. Oh, now they starting to back up. Well, we have, we've had an awesome shoot this afternoon. Changing the recording. Maybe they won't hear something different. Whoo, boys, you see all them geese over there to the west? Y'all hang on. We might get to see something special here in just a little while. Like I say, it's going to take a little while because they're way over there. Jake, you got that exactly right. I've got I've got one motor we run stock, and then I've got another one that's pretty much modded out. And uh, on the 1751, well, both of them are on the 1751 XL, 
F-86s and mods, you know, pretty much everything you can get done to them. Uh, I just want some power. I want to be able to push a big load and get to the places, get up on pad as quick as I can, especially like this past year. It was so damn dry. I mean, it was a, a surface drive motor year. Ain't no doubt about it. Yeah, look at that. So, I mean, we had to take, you, you, that, that motor gets up on the pad a lot better than, come on down here. There's a big one over there too. Come on, show it to us. I know y'all like it. Come on down here. But then I got a 37. This is just a straight up, and I really, really, really like it. Come around, Goose. I don't know if y'all can see them in the sun, but they making a turn. They doing it. Come on down here. That's pretty. That's pretty. I got them, dude. Oh, <laughs> we fixed some butter some of these, boy. I got one did. You got your gun ready, Morton? You got it ready. That boy, he being quiet. He can't stand it. He got that booger finger ready, ain't you? Come on down here. Don't you push that up, dog. Come on right there. Come on. Come on. Yeah, look at that. That's what I'm talking about. Come on down here. Come on, come on. Come on. Just how close you want them. Huh? Just how close you want them. Oh, they're going back behind us. I don't like it when they go back behind us. They go back behind us. I can't see. They need to get down a little bit. They're acting a little bit. A little bit spookish. I'm trying to keep that sun out of my face. Look at them through this mess. Boy, they fixing to get rained on. I got on dead that gun. That's pretty. I know it is, Andy. Oh, that don't make you want to spend some money on something. Shotgun, bolts, decoys. And look up there coming at us right there. Y'all just look way up in the sky. There's thousands up there. I mean thousands. And listen, my battery's about to go dead. I hate to say this, boys, but we're going to have to end our live feed here. And I'm just going to let it run until it go dead. Just because a lot of people don't get to see this mess right here. And this is what it's all about. We're going to probably just let that big old group fly on just to say we could have done. Look at that goose. I mean, that goose right there in my group. And that one right there landing. It just don't get no pretty. I don't it. Look here, he's gonna land on my head in the decoys. Oh, he's on my foot. Oh, he is on my foot. See that, boys? Oh, it's all about all oh, what you're doing, how you're sitting, and having the goose right there on your face. Y'all look at that. Y'all see that right there? Oh, I guarantee it. Freddy King done brought it to you right here on your face, in your living room, in your office. <laughs> Ain't no boy to be happy. Get him. Get him again. Get him again, I said, boy. Put him on the ground right there. Sit. <laughs> that was awesome. I'm telling you right now. That's oh, what it's about, ain't it? That was, that was awesome. Y'all got to say, boom. <laughs> hey. Yes, sir. Great, wait, great call. Boom, shaka laga. Right. I got on it. But boy, that right there, I'm going to end this thing right here because I'm going to get my gun. Hey. I got to fill my tube back up. <laughs> I can't tell you. All right, I'll fill that tube back up. I hear it is. Listen, I'm going to tell you this right now. What I'm going to tell you, dang, that was so kind of pretty. Y'all just don't understand. I'm going to tell you like it is. But I'm going to be doing some live feeds later on, do a lot of things up through the year and all that kind of mess. So. Be a little bit more bolt and mud buddy, and even retriever trainer oriented. TRT, baby, I guarantee it. Right there, the retrievertrainer.com. Stay tuned.
So we're going to show you how to put some ducks down. We got a lot of stuff coming, I guarantee you, right here at Mud Buddy and XL. That'd be a guarantee.